This video will show you how to create a template in Wixie from scratch. Log into your Wixie teacher account. At your home page, use the new button and select an orientation to begin a blank file. Give the file a name to make it easier to find later. Use the image button to add images from your computer, Picks for Learning, or from Wixie's stickers library. You can hold down the shift key to select more than one image at a time and then choose the add button. Drag the stickers where you want on the page and then use the blue handles to resize them. If you're creating an activity where students drag objects, you can turn off scaling handles to prevent students from accidentally resizing the images when they only meant to move them. Use the arrow tool and drag across all of the images to select more than one at a time. Go to the edit menu, choose properties, and select scale to turn this property off. If it would be helpful for students to have objects clone when they drag them, such as coins or these base 10 blocks, you can also set objects to clone. To set a clone, go to the edit menu, choose properties and select clone. Use the paint tools to design your page or use the background picture button to add a picture behind your work. Use the text button to add a header, label, or number. Add a text box and leave it blank if you want students to add their own information into it. To add template instructions, select the clipboard on the tool palette and type your instructions into the field. And you can also select it to open to instructions when the students open it. Use the page button to add additional pages to the template. If you have objects, such as this one, that you want to make sure users don't move or delete, select that object, go to the Edit menu, choose Properties, and select Lock. To assign or share the project, select the Home button in the upper left-hand corner. Select the three dots to the right of the file and choose Assign. To share the template with other teachers and students at your site, select the three dots and choose Move To. Use the back arrow to navigate to your school or your district folder. The Move button will change to copy here so you can keep your original file. Now students can use the file and teachers can assign the template you created.